What is up guys, who are here? Johnny here. Back here with a brand new video. We are talking about Conch Piercings 101. Everything you need to know. But before I begin, please make sure to subscribe and let's get on with the video. Number one on the list is location. This piercing is right over there. Yeah, see it in the middle section? Not a top section right here, not bottom. Right snap, smack dab in the middle. Easy as that. Number two on the list is healing time. This generally will take anywhere from six to nine months. Uh, six being the earliest you can switch it out, but more than likely it's gonna take about nine months to fully heal. So please be patient during this process. Number three on the list, next up is starting Julie. Now with the conch piercing, you wanna get started off with like a pushback or a flat back. Use like a jam, opal, some kind of cute design that's designed or crystal or stone in the front. It's like flat in the back of a lot of beautiful different types of jewelry. We got some of those by you, I'm just saying. Uh, and of course, you do not want to get started with the hoop just because of the how the ring is formed. And just the initial healing process with the hoop causes a lot of complications, irritation, a lot of fun stuff that's going to go wrong. So yeah, start with the studs, not the hoops. Number four on the list is what this piercing actually feels like. Initially, when you first get this piercing, you're going to feel a nice pow. Pow! Yep, that kind of sound. Pow! And it's a little bit of pressure. Sorry. And then it falls by it feeling really hot. And then it just slowly goes away. Pretty much a pow and then like a, a warm sensation after you're done. Well, yeah, because it's like that quick you know? it, This piercing uh, definitely depends on like who does it because if someone does pierce it slow, it's gonna be very excruciating. Ooh, imagine like slow and it's like. If they do it quick, it's, a, it's gonna done, over with. Pa! Yep, just like that. Or pa. Yeah, you don't want that. Number five on the list is aftercare. And of course, what do you want to use? For this is a saline one wash solution. All you want to do is spray the front, spray the back, twice a day, use a Q-tip to clean off the excess debris, gunk, and stuff like that. And that is really it. No alcohol, no peroxide, no ointments, potions, lotions, creams, serums, nothing like that. Sterile saline time you go you can buy from losebydrug.com or any kind of wherever you're gonna get it from. Saline solution. Don't make that shit at home. Quick tip for anyone that's uh, looking to get this piercing. Most people are looking to get this piercing because they do want a ring. Definitely let your piercer know in advance they do want a ring. And if they know what they're doing, they're usually gonna measure for the spot of the ring on the ear. And you'll see them hold up a ring to your ear or some kind of tool to measure and mark accordingly. If they don't do that and they just kind of like, uh, go, for it. go for it, it's kind of uh, shady unless they've done it for like hundred years. They obviously probably can eyeball it, but usually it's right to measure a ring on the ear just so you have the exact measurement of where it's gonna go. So later on when you do switch, it's a perfectly fitted ring on your ear. Next up is, these are the don't do those. Do that, right? Do that. So the first one is of course, don't, don't switch that that early. Like seriously don't. Second is, don't play with it. Stop. And the dirty, just yeah. stop fidgeting with it. Fidget yeah. something else, get a fidget spin or something. Of course, be cautious changing, because I mean, you know, and of course sleeping on it. Definitely a big one. Sleeping on it, headphones, earmuffs, stuff that goes over helmets, stuff that goes like this. And these are the don't do that. All right, guys, that is it. If you're looking for any kind of jewelry aftercare, go check out lewisbodyjewelry.com. Make sure to subscribe, turn on the post notifications, tune up for every single time we post. Peace!